So here's the story. Dish says Neville Ray testified 14 times about CDMA timeline. All right, so this is why I feel so strongly that T-Mobile is going to have a really hard time winning against Dish with this 3G CDMA shutdown of the old Sprint network on CDMA. The CPUC, the California Public Utilities Commission, is really pushing back on this. All right, the Dish is saying that they have up to three years during this Sprint and T-Mobile merger situation. That would be until July of 2023. T-Mobile says that they want to shut down the network. It was originally set for uh, January 1st of 2022. Now they want to push it back three months. I think DISH is going to get their way. I think the CPUC is going to get their way. And the reason for this is all based on the Neville Ray testimony in which he said they would need up to three years in order to merge the networks or integrate the networks and get all these other customers off of 3G and onto, you know, LTE and 5G devices. One statement attributed to Ray I would also reiterate that T-Mobile intends to maintain the 800 megahertz spectrum for three years to support CDMA service during our migration process, that we have an option to lease four megahertz of spectrum for additional time if required. That says for three years, additional time if required. (laughs) That would be even beyond three years. T-Mobile expects that all Sprint customers are likely to be completely migrated within three years. That's Sprint customers. There are also Boost Mobile customers on that CDMA. These are damning testimonies. This is why I think the CPUC, as well as DISH, and the Boost customers who are still on 3G, are going to get their way. This is going to play out for longer than what T-Mobile intends. They said that they needed up to three years to do it, more if longer. And this is why, again, I think T-Mobile is going to lose this. This is a losing battle for them. I know they want to bury Dish. I know they don't like Dish. Put all that aside. All you have to do is look at the language and the testimony. Neville Ray said we don't need that spectrum for three years. This is the way it's going to play out. It's literally in the testimony. Not much you could say about that.